In today's video I'm going to talk about 5 ways Twinmotion is going to change your renderings if you're working with SketchUp. My name is Katerina, I'm a garden designer and I'll see you there. Welcome to another Garden Design Tools video. This video is dedicated to Twinmotion and 5 ways it's going to change your renderings if you're already working with SketchUp. So number one, realistic materials. Okay, so let's just go first to this model in SketchUp. So this is with the edges off. Uh, this is the way um, I normally used to uh, back in the day when I was just using SketchUp to sell my ideas, sometimes with the edges on, sometimes off. But this is basically is missing vegetation, of course, that you can add from the 3D warehouse. But this is basically um, the best version without using any other software, any other rendering, rendering engine. Uh, that you can reuse like Enscape, V-Ray inside um, SketchUp, uh, but without using any other uh, software, this is um, probably the best what you're going to get in your normal SketchUp model, okay? With vegetation, and it's pretty good. I love SketchUp. I work at SketchUp to 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 get the 3D, the, all the structure and the architecture and the layout of my designs up, but Twin motion and Lumion programs like this really change the game up. Okay, so Twin Motion right now for non-commercial use is free until December 2021. So, and this is the Twin Motion 2020 version. Okay, so I really, really, really suggest that you download the game, the the software. It's an amazing software. It has a lot of uh, possibilities. Um, is lacking on the vegetation side, especially uh, uh, flowers, grasses, ornamental grasses, uh, um, shrubs. For me, it's lacking a lot, but you can still use, you can import from the 3D warehouse and use the same vegetation that you will use in your SketchUp model. You can use in Twinmotion as well. Okay, so let's check out the same model. This is not a model of mine. I will put the link to this model from the 3D warehouse. Okay. So let's check out how it looks, the model in twin motion. So number one, realism of materials. That's how, uh, that's the first reason you should really get into twin motion if you're working with SketchUp, okay? You have a lot of uh, websites and in twin motion you have great materials, okay? A lot of, uh, they have a, a great library that you can uh, check out in uh, twin motion with uh, with uh, realistic materials and what I like they have a thumbnail always as well it's it's pretty cool and pretty easy and this is just a drag and drop kind of thing so it, it works pretty well if you want to check it out straight away you can see how it looks sorry guys this is a bit heavy the model I, I add a lot of vegetation um, so straight away you can check out how it looks in your it's just a drag and drop kind of thing and you and of course you can change you can rotate materials and things like that um so don't worry about it reason number two reflections water and garden these features change completely when using a rendering engine like lumion or twin motion twin motion in this case water material being in the swimming pool or water filter changes a lot of what you can get using only SketchUp, okay? Uh, so this is my reason number two for you to get into Twinmotion. Reason number three, animations. In Twinmotion, like other programs, you can create animations of your project very easy and fairly quickly, okay? And you can add other stuff. You can add people, you can add cars, you can add movement if you're doing a big urban project, for example. Twinmotion is an amazing way to get into, into uh, doing quick animations. My tip here is to be short and slow, okay? So short clips, but in really slow, calm way, okay? Just, we have uh, other videos just uh, um, talking about some tips for a more cinematic kind of animation, but really pay attention. Don't start, don't try to do uh, a presentation of your whole garden in one go, okay? Because the movement of the camera, you get really dizzy, but really short clips, Check out other videos we have got in your, our YouTube channel. But animations are definitely my number three reason to get into Twin Motion. Number four reason to get into Twin Motion, and definitely one of my favorites, is the setting of growth for the trees. Okay, so. 
Comparing vegetation with Lumion, Twinmotion doesn't have uh, as many uh, models in their library as, Twin, as uh, Lumion right now, but this is growing, okay? But it has a setting that I really, really love, and that's growth. So basically, just showing here, each uh, tree has uh, three uh, images in their thumbnail. So that's the three phases of growth you can have automatically when you apply this tree to your model in your twin motion. So basically, I have here some some uh, trees planted. So when I when uh, when I'm in my settings, I have a different growth, and it's it's not just the, not just making the trees bigger they actually growing them properly like they they uh, they they supposed to in terms of structure in terms of the canopy so that's pretty amazing okay so that's a pretty cool thing and i love uh, trees uh, in twin motion i think they do a great job i'm just hoping to see more vegetation for this okay i'm just going to show you quickly one thing as well that i like in the images so depending on the season and this regarding vegetation depending on the weather that you apply to your images so it automatic automatically changes the the trees okay you change the colors you change the fruits to show how they will look in that season so if you're changing from spring to summer or something like this on the winter it changes the settings and they are pretty specific to that species of tree so that's a pretty cool thing i think twin motion winds comparing with other rendering e engines even uh, lumion for example um, and that's my reason number four to get into twin motion so final reason and reason number five to get into twin motion fifth reason to get into twin motion if you're working with SketchUp already normally is uh, reason number five to get into twin motion is presentation possibilities especially really considering the time we're living in you should really see what tools can you get to present your projects not just as a still image but to present them really in the best way you can sell the or design ideas even if you're far away from your client okay at a distance so you have the still images, you have panoramas, you have animations, but you have something in Twinmotion as well that's called presenter mode. And that basically you create a whole experience, interactive experience that you can add notes, you can add animations, you can add um, panoramic images that your client can visualize in 360 all in one space interactive space that your client can change even the 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 weather and how it look throughout the day okay um and this and you can add notes for specific areas so you control a bit of what the client is uh, is going to look at but it has freedom to go around the project as well okay and this is one of my favorite tools after the growth tool in twin motion i've done a video about it and i'll link it below so this is my fifth reason and one you should really consider especially because the software is free right now so you don't have much to lose to be honest just time uh, to get into it so just a few things that the is lacking on vegetation but this you can you can add the vegetation that you are normally already use in sketchup uh, a, a, a tip i'll give you is even if, without being just the trees everything else leave it in the model when we import it into twin motion uh, any flowers anything like that just leave the trees things like ivy you can add here in twin motion have some nice um growing ivies um but the materials and everything you add into in motion but leave the plants leave the flowers in sketch or in your sketchup model and just import it like it is if you want okay so check it out check out the course we have online a course a course in uh, in twin motion okay so in twin motion intro for garden designers if you want to check it out um i think it's a great uh, bit of software it's free non-commercial use until december 2021 and it's uh, if you consider purchasing, if you really wanted to use it for your business, it's only two hundred and fifty dollars, and it works on Macs. So I think you have a lot of advantages with Twinmotion. Uh, I will add some uh, images 
um, in the end of this uh, video, some renderings that I have done from Twinmotion without any effects. One thing I'm, it's lacking a little bit is the editor, the effects that you can actually apply in Twinmotion. But if you're good with Photoshop or apps like Snapseed, for example, in your mobile, um, you could tweak a little bit the images. These ones are just coming from Twinmotion, okay, without any post-production. I hope you enjoy it and I see you in the next one. Stay safe.